4 Temmuz 2003 günü Süleymaniye Kuzey Irak'ta 10 askerimle birlikte bölgenin güvenliği için hizmet verirken daha dün çayımızı içen beraber çarpıştığımız adamlar karargahımıza baskın düzenleyip bize silah çekti. var. 100 Amerikan 60 yerel askerin yarısını vuracak gücümüz var. Bunların amacı arama yapmak değil komutanım. Çay verdiğimiz adamlar bize silah doğrultuyorlar. Bunların eylemi bize yönelik değil. Türk milletine yönelik. Ölmek için 10 askerimle birlikte emir ve görüşlerinize hazırım komutanım. Komutanım ölmek için emirlerinizi bekliyorum dedim arz ederim. Search whatever you want and get out of here. Yes, sir, Major. There is no safety for our allies outside. You ask for permission to search the building. We will not go out. Kill us if you need to. Make no mistake, we will kill you. In lieu of that, we're going to take you back to headquarters for questioning. You mean interrogation? For what? We'll find out. That's why it's called questioning. While we're here, why don't you tell us where the C4s are? We are soldiers. We are not prisoners nor captives. Your men are not in uniform, or are you for that matter, which makes it very hard to determine whether you are terrorists or soldiers. Unless, of course, we interrogate you. You are not in uniform. You have no rank. You have no authority. You are not even a soldier. Was a soldier. Arrest him. You have no right. Do not humiliate us, soldiers. Major, these men, soldiers, have their pride. Make sure no one sees their face. Yes, sir. Türkler yağı basmış. Kim basmış? Amerikalılar.
Sevgili kardeşim. Irak'ta olduğumuz her gün şunu düşündük. Bizim burada ne işimiz var? Ama zaman içinde gördük ki... ...bu topraklara her hükmeden... ...bu toprakların insanlarına zulmediyor. Bunu bir tek atalarımız yapmadı. Ve biz... ...maalesef o gün... ...atalarımıza layık olamadık. Adalet için... ...zulmü önlemek için... ...şerefimiz için... ...ölemedik. Şimdi ben bunu... ...senden istiyorum. Ne acı değil mi? Kardeşin... ...Süleyman. Vatan sağ olsun. الرجولة مثل الفلايكة، المرأة مثل اللحية. إيش كت ما تقول اللحية حشنا، الفرشة راح تبللها. أول شيء لازم تبلل اللحية. تبللها، تبللها، تبللها. تعال يا علي، تعال. عايز تسمع؟ بابا. بين أمك، ولا؟ İleride çevirme var. Bunlar asker mi polis mi? Şehirde polis, dağda asker. Bir ayrım yok. سنبقى أسرى إلى أن نتغلب على أنفسنا بابا ليلى يا بنيتي لا تنزعي إلى أن تصيري الحرة فاسا بورتو كانتا Evet Rain. Kaldı kim tava? Amu tava var. Et o kürdi. Bale. Ver ne huveri tertişten de keyin. Abi inmemizi söylüyor. Bir şeyler verelim gidelim. İneriz kardeş. Ben lan sereke. Tamam şer, ne o sereke sen bekken. Evvel aklım ne kırık. Müşküle dermeyin. Hiç niye? Ne göre işi koy bu kata bile. Ne var taçı? Ne pasaportun üstüne? Ne ton persi? Polat Alemdar. O da şey evleri. Yo ticaret. Ticaret içi. Ticaret insani. Lere hezane. İnsan krino. Foştun. Rejmenli abi. Rejmen, rejmen. Diyorlar Abdülay. Yere çök abi. Ne bir rejmen? Vaki insani teftiş manken. Min ne ardı rejmen abi? Ne bir rejmen? Gidelim.
من هاد اللحظة هاد هادي هذا ذكرى الأجداد كلش نفس أجدادنا من أعز سلاتنا يوبي تركوا للذكر من زوريتنا كل منهم يقدم لزوجته حتى يحمل نسيل وشرف العائلة أمانة ابني وياي أمانة ابني وياي حقيقي؟ طبعا عمره ألف سنة هاي من ايش وقت الرياجيل يقدمون هدايا غالية للنسوان؟ غيارة أوانس قولكم أنكم إلى رجل مو هيك؟ أني خدت هدية الحقيقية ما خدتي لك فتش الله وعليكم السلام شلونك الريس؟ اهلا وسهلا شرفتنا ابو طارق نعم مو قلت لك ابني مثل ابنك بعدك تقول على الريس انا اليوم بطرف ابنك وابني لكن ليلى بنت المخربه وقتها مكانها خاصة Nobody open fire yet. They will open fire soon. You'll see. Gentlemen, the Grand Hamilton is the second hut. The air can do not hold it. Abroy. Here from the station. They would like to speak with you. I'm listening. We will go to the station. Which station? Don't cause us travel with them. Which country station are you inviting me to? Raqqa, Kurdistan. I do not acknowledge you. Let the owner of this place come and get me. The building is surrounded. You'll come with me. Bring me the manager of this hotel. Now. If not, neither we nor you can leave this building. Problem. Who 
Who's in charge of this, uh, this gathering here? It's a medic. Sorry for bothering you, Mr. Fender. Please have a seat. Listen, Mr. Lender, I don't know what the trouble is, but certainly my hotel is not the place for all of this. Unfortunately, this is the exact place. Please do sit down and send these men away. Your customers are being disturbed. No, no, not there. Please. Can I ask you a technical question? How many main supporting columns does this hotel have? Excuse me. Let me explain. Your hotel has six main supporting columns. When I blow up the first one, we will get shaken. When I blow up the second one, the building starts to bend. And with the third and the fourth one, the building crumbles upon itself. But I installed C4s on the other two main supporters. Formality. What do you want from me? First of all, I don't want anyone get hurt. Please evacuate this hotel peacefully. Those responsible will come with us. I am the guarantor to this wedding. Sam Marshall is my friend. There is nothing you can find here. If it is necessary to bring someone, I will bring the one with my own hands after the wedding. They will come with us right now. Line them up now. We need to see everyone's IDs. Okay, IDs.
the hotel has been evacuated now. How can we settle things with you? Are you trying to compromise or are you trying to negotiate? Which one do you prefer? Sam William Marshall. I want him here. Mr. Marshall has nothing to do with our hotel. Isn't he on your payroll? Isn't the boss of the American soldiers the American capitalism? Excuse me? Call him. Please. Hello? Hello? Hold on. Sam? Yeah, I'm listening, Fender. Sam, we have a situation here. You have to come to the hotel. I can't do that. I'm going to an exhibition. Sam? This is serious. Hello, Sam. Who's this? I am the one who's going to blow up the Grand Herald. If you do not grace us with your presence. I would like to have the dessert menu, please. I heard American apple pie is very famous. Am I wrong? Abi, bana da künefe. Apple pie dedin ya abi. McDonald's'ta da var. Contact the bomb disposal team. Notify the hotel. I know who the hell these bombers are. Pass on my apologies to the Kurdish leader. I will not be able to attend the ceremony this evening. Oh, wait, wait a second. Job in there, Lieutenant. They'll be traveling for hours. They'll die of suffocation from them there. You're right. Stop the car. Stop the car! Making sure that they could breed now. See, now they're not gonna suffocate to death. <laughs> These people may be terrorists, but you need to remember we're soldiers. Let me tell you something. Don't you ever speak to me like that again. Do you understand that? I'm reporting you. You're a disgrace. I don't give a fuck who or what you report to me. Now get the fuck out of my face. You aren't going anywhere. I'm placing you under arrest. Dear guests, I'm sorry to announce that Mr. Marshall will be not able to attend due to an unexpected business development. going to be in pain for a while. So keep the morphine flowing. Good. Good.
What kind of bastard did this? Insurgent, sir. Stop lying to me and tell me the truth. How many times have I told you that these are living people, not animals? I have more respect for animals, sir! Oh, yeah? If you don't stop killing my patients so I can remove their organs properly, I will kill you while you're sleeping. We'll kill you. My God. My God. Let's remove the injured into the infirmary right now. Right now. <laughs> Let's be a little more patient, please. He'll be here soon. I am okay, but what you are doing is so wrong. Abdülay, yaptığının çok yanlış olduğunu söylüyor Mr. Fender. So who are you? My name is Polat Alimda. You're Turk? I am Turk. What do you wish to gain by this? Mr. Fender, we bothered you more than enough. You can also leave the hotel. Thank you. Are you aware of how much trouble you're going to be in? Are you aware of the trouble that you are sitting on? What's your aim? Blow up the hotel if you want to. There's nothing you can take from me. There's nothing I want from you. But there's something you can give to me. I will slip this suit on your head. It will be the same with your men. And all of you will exit the hotel like this. And the journalists will take pictures of you. You can give me this much, can't you? And I will give you the Grand Haralton in return. And I go away. And these hoods, are they the same ones that I put on your soldiers? Put this on your head, while it's still attached on your body. If not, I have body bag. That will suit you. All right, look, Turk, I've been in this region for 15 years now. I know Turks very well. They like to boast. They got their own rules. They got their own red lines. They got their stable Iraqi politics. You think uh, if we don't want something to happen, there's nothing anyone can do to make it happen. Let me tell you something. We stepped all over your red lines. We screwed your Iraqi politics, and am I to understand that you are not offended by this, but by these hoods? I'll tell you why you're offended. Because the United States has been paying for you for the last 50 years. 
We send you the elastic for your goddamn panties. Why can't you produce anything? If you say you want money, we send it to you, but you steal and cheat each other for it, then ask for more? You say you want guns, we send it to you. You want to do battle, but you want to bargain with us before sending in your troops? And then you ask for more money. How can you forget how you begged us to save you from the communists? No wonder you're offended. We don't need you anymore. I am not a leader of a political party. Nor a diplomat, neither a soldier. I am a Turk, as you pointed out very well. I wreck our coupon, those who put hoods over a Turk's head. No. Shut up and put this on. What? All right, blow it up! Blow it up, see if I give a damn. Do it! You blow up my cob, I'll blow up yours. You, wait a minute. Look. Everyone has a sensitive spot. Yeah, you touched mine by throwing the hood in my face. That wasn't very nice. I know yours, though. Bring him in. Hateful man. Nah, I love children. You know why? Because they're fearless. Like me, they are not afraid to die. It's just when they grow up, they become like cowards. Like all sinners. You know, sometimes I wonder what the world would be like if we killed all the children before they grow up. What do you think? You're a baby killer already. How many children did you kill to get these dirty babies here? Now you tell me that I cannot kill them? Let me tell you something. I won't kill them. I won't use them. Otherwise, what would be the difference between you and me? Let me tell you what the difference between you and me is. You would not sacrifice 11 men. Meanwhile, you watch your country's fortune go to ruin. I would sacrifice 11,000 of my men if needed. You cannot abandon 30 kids because of your feelings. I would kill every single one of them because of their feelings. I kill all who would ruin the peace. Unlike you, I am not here by coincidence. I am a peacekeeper assigned by God. A peacekeeper is God's child. I do not have a child like you. You want to hit that button, you go ahead, Senator. I leave now. We shall meet again. We gotta get the kids out, if you please, sir. It looks like it's gonna take a while. You children wanna go home? Yes, no. I think they wanna stay. Hey, do me a favor. Get this table out of here.
was great. Bir an eve gelsin de. Allah'ım Abdül'e yanlış sandalyeye oturmasın. Allah'ım beni buralarda bir başıma bıraktırma. Abi patlamadı. Patladı. Sakarlık yapmadım inşallah. Tamam. Seyidi. Erit. Aiş. Ve katil. Ente tırid hayda. Lakin el muhim ma aradahu Allah. المؤمن إذا مات على إيمانه ما يخسر شيء إيش قد ما يعيش فمصيره بيد الله أحسن شيء تسويه هسا هو أن تدعي لغيرك لأن دعائك سيكون رحمة ونورا عليك في نهاية الأمر ليلى الله شاهد اللي يصير ليش ما عم بتاعي قومي يا بنيتي قومي من الله أن يحاسبني إذا بجي أدعل يعتمع لكن قال لي ليش ليش قلت له والله ليش تهزم قنابل داير ما داير جسمي ورمي عليها هم هكذا اللي قلت له بساعة ترى أشوف شو الليلة تاقوت Emru, Baba, خليني أموت نفسي حتى يقتل. ليلى، شلون تظنين؟ أنا حخليش تسوين نفس هالشيء. شلون؟ شلون يعمل هالشيء؟ اللي يعرف بابنا، واللي يفهم الإسلام، 
شلون يفكر بهذا؟ شلون؟ شو اقدر اسوي بغير هالشغله؟ ليلى يا بنيتي قنابل البشريه معصيتين في حق الله الاولى ازهاق روحك يأسا من رحمه الله الثانيه المغامره بارواح الابرياء عاد ما تستهدفين العدو تعرفين كم نفس بريه رح تقتلين اذا سويتي نفسك قمله بشريه ما تعرفين ولانك لا تعرفين فانك لن تقتلي كذا وكذا من الابرياء بل ستكونين كانك قتلت البشريه جمعا ترى ذولي اللي اخذوا يبثون هالفكر بين المسلمين وطلعون انتحاريين كانما يخلقون فتنه حسن صباح من جديد ترى هذا من علامات القيامه هي من عمل الشيطان يا بنيتي انا ادري بلوعتك وقلمك لكن احزن من اشوفك متحمسه القنابل البشريه اللي خلت الناس تتصور المسلمين ارهابيين احزن لا تنسى يا ابنتي ان الله ليس بعاجز بل انما نحن فيه من ضعف وعجز وهوان انما هو بسبب ابتعادنا عن كتاب الله وسنه رسوله وبسبب التفريقه التي نحن عليها كل عمليه انتحاريه تزيد من عجزنا وضعفنا بل ان عدونا يريد لهذه العمليات ان تزداد بل ربما نظم تلك العمليات لا امل لنا في النجاة سوى الاعتصام بحبل الله تعالى فلنتوجه اليه بالدعاء كي نتوحد ونتحرر السلام عليكم. وعليكم السلام. وش قاعد من السفارة؟ حسن أبي، اشتق ولا تعب. ما تعب، خدا فيني، تعبت. شاء You work for the Turkish Special Forces. Then has had many assignments out of the country. On his last mission, he had to have plastic surgery on his face to infiltrate the Turkish mafia. He caused it to collapse, almost single-handedly. The others? They're also his team, Special Forces. Assignment for the government? Not officially. Well, of course, not officially. What the hell's wrong with you people? Dağ Kürtlere, çölü Araplara, petrolü de kendilerine ayırdılar. Bizimse gidecek yerimiz dahi yok. Planı bugün yapmadılar. Bizi bağımsız olarak yan yana bile getirmiyor. Toplantıları kendi himayesinde yapıyor. Yakınlarda toplantınız var mı? Var. Nerede? Pazar. I'm here saving people's lives. You're trying to save the rich. Don't make me report you to the authorities because I will. You are my friend. Let's not forget while we're here. I'm out there every goddamn day 
Busting my ass for your safety. I'm setting Kurds, Turks, and Arabs against each other, and you're complaining about kidneys? What, are you kidney me? I want to know why you're being so selfish. Would you just stop pestering me? Just lay off. I'm, you know how taxed I am? You got any idea? You'd stop bugging me about these trivial matters. All I want is for the prisoners to be treated well. I need them. I don't care who you kill, why you kill them, how many you kill. That doesn't matter to me. But if you're going to bring me bodies, I need you to order your men to stop shooting them on the road. I need the organs alive. OK, what part of the yes don't you understand? Fine. find the hotel bombers unfortunately sir we are investigating the matter to the smallest detail you don't seem to understand this my only objective here is to unify Iraq and to establish a stable government to prove that y'all can live together here in peace as long as you continue to make your alliances to the Turkish world, as long as you, sir, continue to make your alliances to the Arab world, and as long as the Kurds continue to try to establish an independent state, there will be no peace. And gentlemen, I will not have my objective be compromised. Could I get a cold orange crush, please? But you don't treat us equals. We are guilty because we created Saddam. We are all terrorists to you. Why are the people at the wedding take the right as terrorists just because they are open fire today? No, that because you continue to produce terrorists and bombers. Problems? I'll see if I can solve them. Our rich are not being evacuated because of productive power. Families are methodically being forced to migrate because of made up excuses and not just ours. Arabian villages are being evacuated too. Is that true, Abitar? Unfortunately, yes. There is just one reason for that. Oil. We were forced out from oil points, Mosul and Kharkov, one by one. Oil is a great value come out from these lands. Don't we have a right to it? Of course, no one's questioning your rights. But first we must establish the security and then focus on the economic concerns. I mean, how do you expect me to achieve prosperity without stability? Tony Bush. Come on. 
respond to uh, concrete requests, if you wish. There are a lot of innocent Arabs who were arrested or taken under police custody under allegations of terrorist organization connection. There is families. They lost their close relatives in these custodies. I will take care of this matter personally. Our request is clear. We demand the families who have been forced out of their village safe to return. The Kurds must give up treating us like minorities. Okay, I will take care of the migrated families if they've got any problem about their relocation. I will see to it personally that they have a safe return. We need more financial support for safety and stability, and more educated men for the development of the region. You know, there hasn't been an intern or an agent who has not spoken that phrase in a Kurdish translation in the last 20 years.
may hurt a little. And if it does, I have morphine for you. Pure insulins. Well, consider the life they live here. There are people dying to go to heaven, to have that life of happiness on the other side. I don't understand. Those who dream to go to heaven, yet do not embrace our Lord Jesus Christ. I'm not going to heaven and you are? Is that what you're saying? When Jesus departed this world, he gave it to you. And we've been chosen by him to show you the kingdom of heaven. Ow. Oh. Well, I have no objection to that. But my people are the only people who made a covenant with a God. And because of that, he anointed us to be the chosen ones. How can you beat that? Morphine. Sir, one of Pilar Aldemar's man was at the scene, disguised as a bodyguard. You bring me the Turkoman leader. Yes, sir. Wait, wait right there. Benim konuşmadığım hiçbir şeyi konuşma. Tamam. seconds or was it Sam or was it the men I sent from Turkey are going to open fire on you and your men after the bomb which was it Nerede kaldınız Abi yollar berbattı Buradan çıkmamız lazım güvenli değil Aha you are treating us unfairly again we were all there. All of our lives were in danger. Hassan, I am going to ask you one more time. Where is Polat Alamdar? Polat Alamdar? Where's Polat Alamdar? Hazır tutar. Abi evlerde insanlar yaşıyor. Evleri patlatacağız demek.
track of them here, sir. Search every house. Okay, sir. You too. Can I help you? If you're hiding someone in your house? Yes. There is no one except my grandma and me. Where is your husband? In heaven. You know what kills the Arabian men? No. What? They're women. All the houses are clear. Let's go. Let's go. What's your name? What does matter? I would like to know the person's name that I'm indebted to. You will learn it when you are paying your debt. saved our lives. You welcomed us into your home and you have shown great hospitality. But we must leave here. Americans are everywhere. We must wait a little more. If we wait for the Americans to leave, we will get old later. We must get some information from outside and we will come into it. What kind of information do you need? Let me get it. No, you can't get it. Maybe Abdullah. But they will recognize him. Hey, yemek geldi. If you and Arhan go out, 
Will you be able to wander around freely? My lord, sometimes I want to rise up against you for not letting me be by your side. I understand that my obligations to you are not complete. Blessed is the man that endureth temptation. When he is tired, he shall receive the crown of life. May you bless the souls of the departed heroes and the heroes to come. May you comfort our own, and may you always guide us. These are sacrifices in our high calling, the defense of our Lord and the peace of the world. My Lord, I shall try to fulfill my obligations to you with all the power I have. This world was created so that I may prove my devotion to you through my deeds before you return to the world. Grant me the ability to resolve the conflict in Babylon that you promised in the Holy Bible. And as the next generation shows their appreciation to their heroes who will build the kingdom of God, it would be an enormous honor should they remember me in their prayers. When St. Petrus left Rome, my lord, you asked him, Quo vadis? Where are you going? This is Babylon, my fatherland. You will not ask me where I am going, I promise you. I will die in these lands. My blood will flow in these lands. My blood will flow till the promised time comes, till you return here, till the promised lands become ours. When the promised land becomes ours, peace will reign and the peacekeeper will be God's child. To share with you a surprise I'm not supposed to tell actually we cannot forget what Mr. Marshall did for this country for us as Iraqis we have informed Baghdad our gratitude regarding Mr. Marshall our honorable president didn't leave our gratitude unanswered Mr. Marshall please call me Sam already would you? Uh, Sam I would like you to accept a piano, which even now is on train from Saddam's palace, especially for you in gratitude in the name of the Iraqi people. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Thank you. I'm very honored, deeply honored. Thank you. Is that? Oh, wow. Look at that. Thanks again. Thank you. Listen. Judgments are done, the Arabs are done. Come up on the phone. سمعنا وأطعنا والله غالب على أمره مهما كان الظاهر ومهما كان الغالب ومهما كان المغلوب فإن الغالب الحق والحاكم الحق والمسبب الحق هو أنت يا رب لقد ابتليت بالهزيمة حتى حبيبك المصطفى إنك لا تظلم الناس شيئا يا رب ولكن الناس أنفسهم يظلمون إنا آمنا وصدقنا نعم لقد ظلمنا أنفسنا حيث لم نتوحد في سبيلك وإنما فرقتنا الأهواء وباعدت بيننا الشهوات يظلمنا العدو لأجل ظلمنا لأنفسنا يا رب نعوذ بك من ظلم العدو ونعوذ بك من غضبك لقد غدونا من الغافلين المذنبين فبتنا من المحكومين المغلوبين 
لم نستيقظ لصوت القرآن والسنة فأيقظنا غزو أعدائنا فالطف بنا يا ربنا وامنحنا قوة وطاقة ندفع بهما ذلك الغزو أنعم علينا بالثبات والصبر الجميل اللهم بجاه نبيك الكريم الذي بعثته بالإسلام دين السلام أعنا على أن لا نترك أخلاقه في الحرم وابعدنا عن المحرمات في القتال sees you, you can be cold. He had me stuck in here. He's oppressing people, and I can't do anything. Sam is doing nothing here. The oppression has nothing to do with you. Nobody can want him that more than me. But there is nothing to do except show him patience. Where did you learn to be that patient? I learned the part that I can endure from my life and the part that I can resist from my shame. Shame? Abdurrahman Halis Kerkuki. He brought me up. Your mother? Your father? I never saw my father. And I was too little to remember when my mother died. He brought me up. Like he did all homeless and orphans.
What do you want to do most in this life, Leila? I used to have just one dream. It was to close my eyes and give my last breath in this tent while looking at the stars. Now? My only desire is now to shove this into that vile man's heart. Only then I will be able to understand that he has a heart or not and die peacefully. If I prevent you from fulfilling your desire, will you get mad at me? Usta, hareket halindeki trene nasıl bineceğiz? Yaklaşınca atlayacağız Mehmet. Piyanonun başında kimse yok mudur? Varsa vuracağız. Eğer ses çıkar. O zaman vurmayız, trenden aşağı atarız. Yok, vuramayız. Anlarlar. Of. Kimse yoktur inşallah. <gülüyor> i̇nşallah. Of, of. Geliyor. دير بالك على رايح والجاي لا تتذمر من الطلبات والشكاء اللي تواجهك هذا المكان لا بيتي ولا بيتك هذا بيت للي ما عنده بيت أمرك سيدة لا تنسى يا يوسف الصبر لا يعني الذل الصبر كفاح running to the Arabs run to him who are his best friends Kurds who is this man for God's sake his lineage goes to the Prophet everyone respects him I don't give a damn about his lineage as long as he stands in the way of what I'm trying to do here he is a leader of terrorists please don't talk like this sir if it weren't for his grace Abdurrahman Khas Karkuki who would look after the the orphans the widows the unemployed the helpless then everyone will become a terrorist. Well, if this man is as great as you say, maybe he should be president of Iraq. For years I've been telling you this man is dangerous. For years you have been ignoring me. So what's it gonna be, me or him? What's he paying you? I don't receive any payment from anyone. Mobilize your men. Go and arrest this sheikh. Yes, sir. I'm not going to take part in this. I'm sorry, I couldn't hear that. Can you repeat that? My father, my grandfather, even the grandfather of my grandfather, all of us grew with the, with the bread of that village. He saved us from the tyranny of Saddam. I can't, I can't even raise a gun at him. He will paralyze us. Paralyze? 
That makes this man a wizard. No. No, Sam. You don't know about him. I know enough. Thank you. I think this meeting is over. Каждая целую. سوي الشيء اللي عجبك هلا I'm just a journalist Do you understand That isn't the most hideous thing I've ever seen. Thank you. We're trying to work inside. 
Ölmüş abi. Harbi mi usta? <gülüyor> you have to get out of here. I won't go anywhere. He's dead now. What is gonna do? Will his filthy ghost disturb me? Leyla, the hard part has just begun. The newcomer who will replace him may find out that you have contacted us. How will he do that? Leila, somebody must have seen you and Herhan together. Oh, çocuklar dışarıda bağırıyor Türkiye sizinle gurur duyuyor diye. Siz hala oturuyor musunuz? Dur oğlum, bir şey konuşuluyor. Sanki anlıyorsun. Will you be safe with the Sheikh? Why? خبر از مامروب برای ارزاق بشین. دایر آواست. عبدالله. اولدن در امین اومامیم لازم. کاموفلو اول شهری. گلیر کنده بی آرچ بول. Malzemeleri indir. Tamam abi. Dinleyin siz. Does your shay come to the morning prayer? Certainly. my face over there. Koca ne diyor abi? Allah büyük diyor Abdülay. Benim bir de İstanbul'a dönüşü var diyor. Hizanım ve Pirdo. Halo. Lotu Zineti Türk benim. Şey kabından kere. Nabut şey ya halo. Ne yapayım? Çekil 
چی دمیری چی دم Mati lebih adil. Ben de kürdüm. Sen başkasın Abdül Bey. Her şey böyle başlıyor abi. Patience means wait your turn.
Acı ama yara acım ya. Abi bulmamız lazım.
Shut up.